Hi guys, welcome to the short video about problems with the wireless range of the Blink XT2 outdoor security camera. So this camera came out about I think half a year ago was the successor of the original Blink XT and was supposed to be better two-way audio and extended battery life and so on and so on. And it looks they totally messed it up. Now they have been trying to uh, improve the software and provide a better range. But I've heard from some friends they still are still having huge problems with that and so I'm trying to show you a solution which is cheap and still works I mean we can see yeah here there's a lot of things when you google for that wireless range problems you can even find that they have been halting sales of this new device I mean that's crazy that was such a huge anticipated camera and now they had to hold sales i mean that's a huge uh, thing i mean that's a bummer for this company and yeah for everybody i mean a lot of people have been pre-ordering or at least ordering since then and they're having problems sometimes they send it back and they make every couple of days or weeks they're making firmware updates and uh, there's a huge thing i mean they totally messed it up i don't know how such a company can come up with such a release which totally doesn't work i mean totally doesn't work i mean it's a huge uh, disadvantage compared to the old one which was actually pretty good so yeah anyway you can see really a lot of complaints and i was talking to my former neighbor and he told me yeah he has bought this device and he told me yeah he's so upset it doesn't work it always shows that the connection is really bad and it does not even show if the problem is between the camera and the communication module or between the communication module and the router and he's trying around and i think usually it's between the router and the communication module for some strange reason because actually it doesn't make sense because when you try to save power it would be on the camera not on the communication module module which is powered by usb but anyway i don't really understand what they are doing they are always saying yeah move this thing closer to the router and he told me yeah he's totally upset he is tired of the whole thing so he just sees two options the one is to send it back and ask for a refund even after 30 days and the other thing is to buy something like that a whole home wi-fi extending or extender uh, system i mean these things are pretty good they have a good reputation but they cost a lot i mean you can see I mean it's Amazon's choice thing so you have to always be careful I mean usually they will have a high star rating and sometimes I mean uh, Amazon they put a lot of pressure on people making fake reviews but at the end you see they send a lot of these devices uh, when they are coming sometimes from uh, when they are like Amazon's own devices I'm not sure if it's really uh, Amazon's own device, but could be. And sometimes they are sending these devices to their own like wine uh, group. And they will, of course, always give, give five or four, uh, four or five stars. Yeah. So, but anyway, I mean, they, they are really working as far as I know. And, but they are super expensive. I, I think it's not uh, possible to find a really cheap one, maybe $150. And I don't even know if they really work here. Yeah, one for 80, uh, 97, 99 and so on. That's the cheapest, but most of them are four or $500. And he told me, yeah, that's the other thing. And I said, yeah, okay, why, why would you want to have something like this? I mean, it, 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 it's uh, possible to have something way cheaper and it's this thing it's just a wi-fi extender one device and it starts at about 17 dollars and i've been using such a device for years in an office where i was really remote to the main building a little bit i mean to the main room 
and I've just plugged it in. You can use it with the like WPS, I mean this easy uh, button which you can connect it to your router just by pushing a button. You plug it in into just any uh, AC power outlet and then push the button here and then push the button on your router and it will connect and then you can connect whatever device you want to connect to your Wi-Fi you can connect to this router. I've never tried this one I don't know I mean they, they are a little bit different of course always but it shouldn't be a problem to connect any device to these Wi-Fi extender things and they have also really good reviews as you can see 21,000 people have been buying that these can't all be just bought reviews no uh, no no way I mean they have some bad reviews and they are not super easy anyway what I can tell you what usually the limitation is is the throughput so if you have like uh, if you want to use that for gaming or something like that it's not a good thing so I wouldn't recommend that for gaming it will increase your ping it will slow down your connection it will slow down everything but like for a blink camera which has really low network requirements that's an easy thing that should be absolutely a uh, no-brainer to do that $17.99 I will put down the link to these things into the description so if you want to order something like that and give it a try if it doesn't work it's prime you can return it if you think it's totally not working but anyway I would keep it you can use it for anything to work if you want to use it with a laptop out in the patio or in a remote uh, room wherever you need extended Wi-Fi range I mean that's also a good thing to have something in your storage and so you can use that and I can highly recommend that if you are in trouble with your Blink XT or Blink XT2 of course works always also with the Blink XT the old one to extend the range so that's definitely a good thing and I hope uh, I've been able to help you a little bit with that maybe helping you to save some money if you have any questions or comments just write to the comment section below I'm always happy to talk about these things and if you like the video give me a thumbs up subscribe my channel thanks for watching and see you next time